we always forget in our patient that 80%, what we always tell them, uh, listen, 80% of your uh, stroke can be prevented. So it's not, there's no, it's not written in the stones that you need to have a stroke. So absolutely what we need to have more is patient engagement to say it's not enough that I give you the pills. It's not enough that you control your blood pressure. It's a lot of work that we are asking, but you have to follow a good lifestyle. So change your diet, maintain your your weight, go walking and maintain it's it's a hard work to maintain your um, health. It's something that it's easy when you're young, but and then you sometimes uh, you, you abuse of your body because you smoke, you drink a little bit more. But when you're getting over 60, calm down, <laughs> take your time <laughs> and invest on your health, like you're investing somebody, something else. And in and, the end, it's a lot of fun because if you you uh, have a good weight, you will not have any kind of complication. You reduce arthrosis, you you you, are, you move better, you don't fall. And if you, if you have good physical activity, it's better, good for your brain and it prevents not only stroke, but also dementia and depression, which is also a, a major problem in 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 our pay, in our aging society